Hi, we're here for the, the ghost hunters. Yeah. Um, Sorry, she's not a huge believer in this stuff. Come in. Thank you. You said your name was James, right? Ah, uh, yes, and this is my associate, Harold. Is it okay if I set up over here? Oh, yeah, go for it. Oh. What'd you do to your back? Oh, I <laughs> must have pulled it doing something. It's weird, I can't really pinpoint exactly what it was. Guess that's just part of getting older. <laughs> yeah. Uh, sorry about the mess. Do you want anything to drink? Uh, no, I'm fine. Thank you. No one ever asked me. And I didn't mean to be rude earlier. It's just that we've tried everything else, and as much as I don't believe in this stuff... I do. So it's important for me that we try. Look, uh, paranormal researchers, as we prefer to be called, are uh, known to help in situations like this. I totally understand your skepticism, but uh, trust me when I say we are true professionals. Oh, sorry about that. Um, uh, it's fine. You can just leave it there. No, no, no. I got it. Uh, oh, there it is. Sorry. Continue. Thank you. Let's start from the what beginning. What do you have over there? No, don't, don't get him st Oh, this baby? This is a GS2 laser grid sensor array. Shoots out a line and identifies distance, direction, motion, and temperature fluctuations. Basically establishes a baseline measurement so we can monitor any environmental changes. Yeah, they all seen the shows, man. And it's... this is an EMF monitor. It detects small changes in electromagnetic energy, and it'll alert us if there's a presence so we can track down the source easily. You know? And then this guy right here. Oh, sure Thank you, it. Harold. That's great. Glad that they know that Thank now. Thank you, James. I think it's pretty cool. Sure you do. So uh, what did you say was happening? Uh, well, where to begin? Uh, well, just start when the anomalies began. Right. Well, uh, I originally got this place with my ex-girlfriend. Uh, well, she's, she's not really an ex. She unfortunately passed away. Oh, sorry to hear that. Thanks. And... Since then... We've grown closer, and I moved in, but we've just been hearing strange noises, and I don't know, things have been happening. Yeah, yeah, exactly, like like doors slamming, lights flickering, and it, it just keeps getting worse. Worse how? Like, uh, in frequency, or the events started getting bigger, or... Uh... Honestly, kind of both, and I haven't been able to do much because of my back. Yeah. Mm. That was another reason I moved in. I just wanted to help him out. Yeah, yeah and, and, and she really has. But lately, it's just getting harder and harder to live here with all this going on. I mean, it's kind of to the point where I'm considering selling, you know? Well, I wouldn't do that just yet. Yeah, so. the housing markets are pretty bad. <laughs> Thank you, Harold. Thank you, James. Look, I think what we need to do is start with a scan. That way we can figure out if there's a paranormal entity in the space. Now, I, I know we discussed this over the phone. We were talking about the, our initial oh, price. Oh, are, are you thirsty? About. I don't know if I asked that no, already. I'm, I'm I could use a drink. Okay, I'll just get us all some lemonade. Sure. Uh, babe, can you make a coffee? Sure. Like I was saying, we need to figure out the source of the problem. So I think, uh, you know, any information on the history of the home could really help. Things like, uh, was there a murder or a death, or was there, a, you know, was it built on an old burial grave? Stuff like this. Hey, you James. Know. Yes, Harold. Can I talk to you for a second? Excuse me. No problem. What? Where are the batteries for the EMF? What? Why are you asking me now? No, I'm responsible for your bag. Yeah, but remember I asked you back at the office to throw a pack in my bag. I specifically asked you that. I'm not your yippie man, okay? That's not what I do. I, I haven't, I'm the one with the degree. Oh yeah, you say that all the time, but you can't even work a simple thermal imagery. I'm doing all I'm the the face of the company, Harold. I'm the one that gets all the work. Do you understand that? I'm the one trying to make the money. Hey, babe. You need any company. help? Nobody needs me. I can't make a thousand. I told you to make a thousand. They were recording 
They don't know. I just we saying, can't just saying that it's a team effort. Can't do it all. I get all the work. That's like 100% of the effort. You understand that? Look. Hey, Daryl. Yeah. How did you say your girlfriend died again? Lemonade, anyone? <laughs>